What behind the door? It's a wolf. So, hello, I'm back. I've not done a video for a while. That's because I've had a terrible week. Everything's going wrong for me this week. Um, what's what? What was the start? The main fuse on my consumer board for my electrics in my house blew. Could have had a fire. It was. It didn't blow. It was arcing across, and you could hear visibly hear the arcing. So my house could have burned down. Then I went to the parcels to drop off my parcels. Uh, when I went to my mum's, took my dog with me in the car, left the dog in the car, literally gone a minute. In that minute, it had broken out of its holding thing I have in the boot. Um, it's like a thing that attaches to his collar. Jumped in the front seat, bitten through the seatbelts of my car. Lovely. So I've got to get my seatbelt replaced in my car, my rear driver's side and my driver's side front. That's expensive. Then... <laughs> As you might have noticed, the quality is a bit better on the video. I wonder why that is. The touch screen on my phone died. So I had to get a new phone. Ah, oh. and then <laughs> I'll show you. So yeah, not the greatest of weeks. And when I went to recover the data from the phone because I somehow managed to get the touch screen working for mouse and all that bits. The video had corrupted, so I went to go and try and remake it with this phone last night and I realised there's a format which my editing software can't read that this phone does, which I think I've hopefully fixed. If not, I'm going to cry. I'll try it tonight. So, yeah, not the greatest of days, not the greatest of weeks, but let's try and go over what that video was. So hopefully, hopefully it's still a mess. You can tell I've been trying to clean up the warehouse. There's a load of boxes here stacked high. They're all gone. All the stuff by the door. Let's clean that. <laughs> Don't mind that. It's all gone. Um, there's a load of games around. They're now on the shelf. So that's all my bundle fodder of games. Oh, that's annoying because if I put my finger there, it focuses on my finger. If I don't put my finger there, it focuses on the background. I have to learn a quirk so it's fun. Um, so yeah, there are my bundle fodder of games, so I need to... Dog is jumping at me. Oh, you're fun, aren't you? You're fun in games, and don't bite me. He just wants attention to play. And he's calm, hopefully. Are you calm? Are you calm, boy? Who knows? So, after all that palaver, there are all the games that need to be cleaned. Oh, not fun. There are all the discs. Oh. Ah. Hopefully the parts will arrive tomorrow or today. I don't know. We'll see. Bonus clip. Um, new one's arrived. So, compare the two. Look. How much that's just stripped away compared to that. So, let's get a new part in and see if it works. Never mind, I'll have to wait till later. Um to go home because there's a allen key inside there and i didn't even realize i thought he just screwed on as a whole unit but no and by when i go home i will start editing the video so but it will be on the and my disc cleaner will be up and running which is very nice bye bye but yeah um i think while i'm out of action and i wanted to do a unique video but i can't do a unique video i'll do a picking and packing video so Let's get that set up. Where's my laptop? Righty yo, let's go. 31 orders for £521. And we're starting off with Resident Evil 7 Biohazard for Xbox One in 693. It is there. Nice and easy start. Resident Evil Biohazard. Sold for £11.20. I haven't ordered this in SKU. Ah. Rookie mistake. Order in SKU. Right, we'll start off with 16. Two of them. Yeah. Black Ops 3's in 16. Let's go down here. 16, two of them. Lovely jubbly. Sorry about that. Black Ops 3, two of them sold for £9.30 each. Right, there's the Resident Evil Biohazard. Blinks in 9.30. 
blinks, blinks, blinks. 9.30, should be blinks. I think it is, but it's stuck on something. There we go. Blinks, sold for £6.30. 1140, we've got a double 1138 and 1140. Really close to each other. Where are we at? 1138 and 1142. We love orders with more than one item. Micro machines. Oh, I can't tell what the price is talking about. So, micro machines, the original one, sold for £5.70. And Liberty City Stories, sold for £8. Going in a large letter, not bad, not bad. Next one. Card Shark, cheapo game, 1214. 1214. Are we looking here? Nope, I think we're looking here. 1214, Card Shark. At £3.70. That's my lowest price, £4 plus the discount of 6%. Going out. Nice and quick. 1403, nice and expensive one. A brand new and sealed Wii game. Bit of slow sellers, but always nice price to get. Conduit 2. Brand new and sealed. Never seen this game even unsealed. Um, sold for £34. Hunter the Reckoning Redeemer, 1657. It's gonna be here somewhere. Nope. Nope, probably should look up here. Yeah. Hunter the Reckoning Redeemer. Weird looking game, never played it. £8.30. 1683 is the next one. Ah, I would have been right near it. Oh well. What numbers are these? I mean, this box, right at the back. Super Mario 3D World. There we go. Sold for £9.40. 1744 for Trippy Call of Duty 3. It is Call of Duty 3. There we go. Sold for £7.50. Not amazing sales, but they all add up. Well, you know what the total is that they add up to. One eight, oh, one eight three three. One eight three three. Here we go, Rocky. And let's. Oh, while I've got the number in my mind, get the next one. One nine nine zero. I think it should be a Call of Duty bundle. Oh, what's that doing there? That is one of my things I used to clean um, stickers off. Call of Duty bundle sold for four no six pound fifty, and Rocky sold for five pound fifty. Not bad, not bad. Two zero five seven, Black Ops Four. I think that might be. It is in these, but luckily it's a PS4 game, so you don't need to clean. Sold for seven pounds. And let's go back to the numbers that are a bit iffy. 150. 150 should be a steel book for a game that's not very valuable on its own. Drop my phone. Not good. Um, so, brand new steel, steel book for Agents of Mayhem. Sold for £18. And 298 should be a double buster move. Is it going to be in here? It is. Double trouble buster move. I think it's like a. Yeah, it's like a balloon popper game. Weird game. Sold for £7 plus international postage. 376. This was in one of my videos of my pickups. No idea how much I paid for it. Can't remember. But it has sold for £24. Fire Emblem Warriors. And even more down, 79 a game made after a manager. Two games made after a manager. Sven Eriksson. Football game. Who would buy those? Um, sold for four pounds. Very cheaply, someone bought those for. Right. Lenses and that stuff. Let me pull them out and show you. So, after looking for those for way too long than I should have done, you can see down there how many lenses there are. It's ridiculous. 
So this one sold for Canon zoom lens 35 to 105 sold for 35 pounds and they bought special delivery post on that so they must need that quick and a canon 28 mil prime lens for 55 pounds not bad let's put that 50 50 with james as normal um so a kodak retinet let's look for that okay this one should be easy enough because it looks like that not gonna get out of the case because it's like a folded out weird looking camera. Kodaks normally are that type of bit. It's all for £27. Alright, a charge cable, some gaming. B1 and then B6 for a controller. B1 for a charge cable. B1 is not there. B1 will be somewhere else. I'll get that afterwards. B6, PS4 controller. It is there. No others? Nope. Bit of a dodgy joystick. It's probably sold as a B grade. Yep. For £19. Be testing and work, it just needs some new grips. Um, B9 for an Olympus flash unit. Let's see how easy that is to find. Not probably easy because it's in a big crate. Oh no. Oh, maybe. I've seen Olympus flash thing. Is it A16? It's A16. Oh, booyah. Olympus flash unit. Got a weird mounted system, probably for a specific camera. It's all for £14. C5, um, AV cables, just these things, sold for £4.30, so not a lot of profit, but that just reminded me. I made a new system and I forgot to use it. Dog just destroyed everything on the way here. Bonk. Um, just put stuff in these trays that are not games. I'll do that going forward. Oh no, never mind. It's discs only now. I've just stopped. I've just done it when I don't need to. 22 and 37. 22, GTA 5. And 37. 37 is there. Bit the one behind it. Yep, take that one out. It's the last one. Ah, Project Cars 2 sold for £4. And GTA 5 sold for £8.60. Next one, Casper in 142. One, four, two, down here. Nice game, yep. Put that there. Casper sold for £6.60. And we got a Nikon lens in 486. Nikon, Nikon, how you say it? 486. Uh, can I get one? Is this the right one? Yeah, it is. Okay. Just make sure. Yeah. Okay, cool. Okie the dokie. Let's go. Might be the one in front. I might have mixed those up. Yeah, it is. I've mixed those up somehow. Not bad. No, that's right. Okie dokie. 508. Buzz. Buzz. 508. There we go. Buzz, buzz. There we go. Buzz, Toy Story 2, 13 pounds. Some, and then all my, rest of my broken PS2 controllers, which for 60 pounds for 20 controllers, which is all here. So let's take those over. And that last one is a disrepair job. It's 3 99 here, but that's because it's got eBay fees and return postage. It is two pound to anyone who contacts me outside of eBay plus return postage. Right, let's go up here, click that, and let's purchase postage labels to find if it is any um, combined orders on top of what we've already seen. And let's use the tape of hiding addressness. And already we have one. Let's, let's see if there's any more that come up. No, just the one. So let's find out what it is. It is. The Call of Duty bundle, the Mic Machine, and GTA Liberty City. Um, so let's get that. So it was those two which were already in a combined order. Oh god, and then those two. So. Thank you, whoever purchased all those. They will go in a small parcel. Lovely jubbly. Right, let's get packing order. Okie dokie, all them, that, them. And that. 
Time's 12.51 now. I'm saying before 2 o'clock we're going to be done. A bit late started packing up because of... I had to have my dad come over and fix the fuse finally because he just put a temporary one in and to get the seat belts out of my car, which is down there. Um, naughty doggy. Not it. Went straight through my seat belts. Not fun. So, don't eat it anymore. So, I need to send it off to a place to get repaired. Fun times. Not. Let's go. Um, yeah. And we are done. Oh, no, we're not, because they're international. One minute. And we are done now. Um, the three games are going to Australia. Uh, we're a bit beyond my estimation, mainly because of that one being an absolute pain. And I had to go get this box because it's got a lot of thumb grips I wanted to put with that PS4 controller. So, what are we going out? So, we've got that parcel to go one. Um, cost about six pounds to post, and then all these. So there is twenty. Oh, there's a special story. There's twenty large letters and seven small parcels in there, and two special deliveries. And that cost fifteen pounds to post. I think this was ninety-four pounds for all those because there's two special deliveries, one which someone ordered, and then my seat belts. So five hundred pounds about £100 postage, so a fifth of the thing, not bad, especially when it's all tracked and nice, so, very nice, um, let's see how much time I've spent recording, so, I think it's been about a 50, well, it will be about a 15 minute video, so I think I'll call it, um, for today, I've got some bitching to do, because I'm way behind with this absolute disaster of a week, oh, expensive because what new phone seat belt cost me 70 that machine cost me 20 fuse in my house well, that was fiver but it's luck i had a family friend who could repair it could have been a house burnt down jesus so oh but we take the we take the downs with the ups at least ebay's doing well it's just it's just, oh, everything else is breaking on me. Like, it's, it's more the stress and the downtime than the cost, but we work with it. Anyways, hope you've enjoyed the video. My partner will enjoy the packing videos, as always. The dog is not enjoying being on the buyer's lead because he's being naughty, um, but we carry on. We'll see you later. Goodbye.